If the fans can make it, so can you. YouTube, what's good? I'm back again with another video. We're going to check out this Superman demo on the Unreal Engine 5. A fan made this. I'll put the link in the description to where you can download this yourself. He says this game is a heavy, incredibly heavy game now. Lower end, lower end PCs will probably struggle with this. Potentially even on a 3090, which was which is what I have. And it seems to be okay. It's a little laggy here and there. He made this based off the Matrix demo that we all saw. And yeah, let's get straight into this. We're just going to play it, see, fly around, see what it looks like. And yeah, the developers, the companies, y'all should be looking at this, seeing what the fans are doing themselves. I'm playing on an Xbox controller. You can use mouse or keyboard. Mouse and keyboard or controller. Just look at this. Based on that Unreal Engine. Put the sound on. Look at that. And this is just somebody putting in effort on their own part. This isn't a huge studio company doing this. With all the millions of dollars they probably put into the game. Just look at the quality here. All the assets. Cape flapping. Superman, you can change his pose. Look at this. I like this pose right here flying like a G. They got something called the superhero landing. The sound will come in as we get closer to the city. Bow! Or so I thought. Here we go. Now we got the sound of the city flying around like Superman, what's up? This, this reminds me of Man of Steel. Dun 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 <laughs> Remember when Azad and Superman were at a building and they were flying up at each other? <laughs> oh man, they need to make a game! That was epic. That's really how it was in the flew at each other and BOW! This is amazing. And yeah, basically you can fly anywhere you can see. It's the whole city. I do wish you could fly a little faster, but you know. It's whatever, bro. This is amazing. Fun to play with. This is a 20 gig file, I think. Maybe it was like 17 or so. Again, the link will be in the description. If you want to just BOW! <laughs> Like, just imagine flying around like in a full game, enemies, all the powers. You could even I think you could even like super speed run. Oh, just a little faster run. <laughs> it looks a little funny with Superman running like that. So you come in here, bow, you start flying. I think you can even. Ooh! I flipped the truck. Oh, I just flipped the truck on top of the car. Look at the graphics on this, too. This is beautiful. So much potential. Just flying around the city just feels fun. And again, I'll put the link in the description. You're going to have to download Unreal Engine on Epic Games first, obviously, so you can have the engine to play this. And then uh, the, download the file of the game. You'll be good to go. You'll be able to fly around like Superman, have some fun. And if you're inclined to, you can even edit from there. You can do what you want. It's the Unreal Engine. You can make your own game. You can make levels. You can add bosses and powers. I'm sure the guy that made this right now is figuring out ways to, to make this more fun. Unless this is all he wanted to do. Either way, you did his thing. Superman flying. While you're flying, you got like, you can do flips side to side. Look at that. That's just tight. Oh! <laughs> That's just tight. The freak. Oh. 
Basically, that's that's the gist of it. Again, companies, Warner Brothers Games specifically, you should be looking at stuff like this. Thinking about the potential. You see the, how, how many fans and people are out here playing this uh, demo this guy made. People are having a lot of fun with this. We want this game. We want a Superman game. Stop making Batman games. Out the ass. We don't need 30,000 Batman games. And we only got like Superman Returns. And we don't got no Superman games like that. Get a Superman game out here. We don't even got him in the movies. Let's get him in the game, bro. Look at this traffic. I would like to speak to Lois Lane. There's a way to go to the Matrix build, but I don't know how to get back to the... <laughs> you see how he crashed into me? He broke his shit. That was tight. Don't crash into Superman. You're going to break your car, bro. For the most part, this has been stable for me, though. Smooth. Right when I first booted it up, it was a little, a lot, like, very laggy. But I think it was just rendering this entire world that's here, all the textures. Because everything does, there's no pop-ins. That's how good the Unreal Engine is. Once you get the game loaded, everything's loaded up. All the reflections. All the textures, the character, all the bottles. The, the lighting. Lighting in real time. Back to the Unreal Engine. All these cars, all the people, they don't disappear when you go away. They're, they're here. At all times. Filming. Look at that. I like this flying stuff. You can switch it up too, though. I do wish he added some sound effects for the flying and all that in the air. But it's all good, bro. You did a good job. You did more than what the companies have done, bro. I like that effect too, bro. Start to go super speed. Wow. But yeah, let me know what y'all thought in the comments down below about this demo. That's pretty impressive for just a you know a person out here doing this. Obviously, we want to see what what a company could do, or even or even a lot of uh, fans with the know-how get together and do some with this new Unreal Engine. Even, I'll even take that. I don't even care anymore. I want something. Thanks for watching this video. Again, check the description for the link. I'm just a guy with a camera. And a mic. And I'm out. I don't see nothing wrong. I don't see nothing wrong. Just a little subscribe. Subscribe is my I don't see nothing wrong. Go ahead and hit that like button. Oh, you know I like that. Oh, now you better hit subscribe. Oh, bitch, you gonna die.